Hi everyone! Okay. Today, don't mind the hair. It's I just got out of the shower. I haven't detangled it yet. It's a little, it's a little not there, but we'll get there soon eventually. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my skincare routine. My new skincare routine. You saw a little preview of it in my in my day in the life video. Sorry, I was just like not understanding English. But today I'm going to show you my actual skincare routine. And I'm going to show you all the products and all the things and all the things that I use and don't use or do use sometimes. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I use is the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser. This stuff is really good. It's really light on my face. The only other face... The only other cleanser that I used to use was the... Cetaphil cleanser. I used Cetaphil cleanser for a long time and then I'm using this now and it works pretty good. I also use this, which is almost gone, it's the Daily Moisturizing Lotion for normal dry skin because I have like a little dry skin. Sometimes it gets oily, but that's like months in a blue moon. Okay, I also use this Fenty Beauty toner on my face or fat water. It's fat water toner. Um, and I really like this stuff. It makes my face really like shiny and not shiny, just makes it look very hydrated. That's the word, hydrated. Okay, these two products I don't use all the time, but they're actually some products that really help me. So obviously the Mario Badescu drying lotion is a really good product. I use this for pimples and I use this for any place I think I might be getting a breakout or a blemish in. It's really good um, and I really like this lotion. I definitely recommend it. And then I also use the Chanel Hydra Beauty Lotion. This stuff is good for the summertime though because it has like, it's like a water um, it's like hydration and it gives you like if it's sunny and if it's hot and if it's dry outside It'll give you like that moisture you need so it's like extra in the winter It's kind of cold so my my face doesn't really dry out in the winter as much as it does in the summer So I don't really use this that much um, But I definitely recommend this product for anyone who's like looking for a like a hydrating uh, moisturizer Yes, that's the word. All right now I'm gonna do the whole routine I use these paper towels to dry off my face because I don't like the um, idea of using a washcloth because I feel like you're just wiping off your face with the dirt that you already wiped off and it's like I don't want to change it every day so I just use like these paper towels so and it um, encourages me to not like rub my face like really um, aggressively when I dab it like dry it off it just encourages me to um, just... okay so the next thing I use which I actually forgot I... hello I actually forgot I did show is a jade roller. This thing is my favorite thing. Okay, so here's the thing. This jade roller I got from Sephora. It's by Herbivore. Some jade rollers are really expensive. Some jade rollers are not as expensive. This was the only little a little less expensive side. This was like $30. $30 to $40, I'm pretty sure. It has two sides. It's got a big roller and it's got a smaller roller. If you want to pay more for a jade roller, you can. It really just depends on what, like how big it is, how you know how it works if there's like different like tools and things that come with it blah 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 i would recommend getting a skincare fridge and putting this in a skincare fridge i don't have a skincare fridge and i'm going to show you what i do i definitely recommend keeping this cold because when it's cold it works better i use this every single day and every single night i didn't really think my face was puffy before i started using this because i was like i don't get puffy face in the morning what but when i started using this i could actually notice a difference in my face and the puffiness going down I find that when i don't use it the puffiness kind of never goes away so that's something i think i definitely recommend for you guys is a jade roller really really nice so here's what i do since i don't have a skincare fridge i take the roll jade roller and i run it under cold water and then i take this and i kind of rub, rub it on my face for like five or six minutes and i also take the smaller part and i put it under my eyes too because well, i don't want to poke my eye out okay next i'm going to use the fenty beauty fat water and i just put a little bit on my hand. Oh, this bottle is like kind of confusing. Come on over. Don't. Okay. There we go. Take a little bit, put it on my hand, and I put it on my face. After I do that, I take the jade roller and I, um, I rub in the uh, the toner on my face with the jade roller. Okay. Now I'm gonna use this moisturizer. I'm almost out of it. It's like. 
When you're rubbing things on your skin, you should always rub upwards because gravity works upwards and you don't want to go down because then your face will like slow down. But you always want to do like upwards so you don't you don't have wrinkles and droopy skin before you're 30. Okay, that's pretty much my skincare routine. Let me just put my hair up. My favorite hairstyle is putting my hair up in these clips. Okay, so I hope you guys like this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And my shirt is wet because of my hair. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel because I am doing vlogmas, which means I'm posting a video every single day up until Christmas. I said that so many times this week. It's like getting repetitive. And comment down below what your skincare routine is because I'm curious to know. I'm always looking forward to new skincare stuff. And I will link all of these products in the description. So if you guys want these products, you can go grab them. Okay, I love you guys. See you tomorrow. Bye. Christmas tree and